Hey everyone, and welcome to Heavy Metal Hot Sauce. We got Kevin again today. Back again. <laughs> and we have, um, we have a Beaver Dam Pepper. Uh, that might sound weird to most people. Most people probably have not heard that. Well, this is named after both of our hometown, um, a fairly small uh, town in Wisconsin. Um, I'll talk a little more about that, um, but otherwise we have JoJo's um, Beef Jerky Challenge. They say that this is apparently the hottest piece of beef jerky in the world. We'll see about that. <laughs> like, I feel confident. I don't know if this is going <laughs> to just come out of nowhere and destroy us. <laughs> we will find out. We'll see what happens, guys. But um, we're going to try this pepper first, just in case this is a wild card and is absolutely just terrible. But So, yeah, beaver dam pepper. Um, this uh, pepper, uh, but I'm already for starting to forget. Um, Brought from Hungary a hundred years ago. From Yes. And, and, then, uh, and then in the... 50s almost went extinct due to like hybrid and cross pollination and things and um, recently 2010 had been isolated and kind of brought back to its original form um, so yeah a hundred years ago from Hungary and the immigrant came and then started to grow these in beaver dam so we got the beaver dam pepper Never heard about it until a couple weeks ago, yeah. and now we get to try it out. That's cool. That's thick. Thick. Yeah. This is easily the thickest walled pepper I have ever seen. This is totally different from a super hot. I think yeah, this, this isn't a super hot. This is more like a... Closer to a bell. What did you say? A it's, poblano. Yeah, it's... Yeah, so I mean... Probably not gonna have too much heat. It looks like it'd be good for cooking. It has a tomatoey color. Yeah. What does it smell like? It smells like a bell pepper. It smells like a red bell. It smells like it tastes good. Vi like I mean, very I, little seeds. Yeah. The, the like I said, the walls are very thick, and I'm actually gonna hold on to some seeds. Uh, next next season, I'm gonna attempt to grow. A little bit, see how that goes, and with this being rare from hometown, I'm gonna keep a couple of seeds. So we have a pepper festival in our hometown of Beaver Dam every year now, for the last few years, and this is where the pepper was picked up at by Randy. Good friend Randy. Thanks, Randy. I totally forgot to even <laughs> go to the festival. I currently no longer live in Beaver Dam, so. I mean, that's a good amount of juice on the blade. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's, there isn't much placenta. It's pretty much just thick walled pepper. It smells like a bell. I need a break from the spicy hot ones, man. <laughs> that last time I was on. We're at your place. Nightmare, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is gonna this is gonna be a lot better. Complete opposite from last time. Which, uh, all right. I mean, yeah, it's just straight up bell pepper. Beaver damn pepper. Check it out. Thank you, Randy. Really juicy. Whoa. And it does have. It's got a little bit of heat. A little bit. That is delicious. It's very sweet. That tastes so much better than I was expecting. Wow. Very sweet. Can I get another piece of this? Go right ahead. Wow. Yeah, very juicy. Oh, that is easily the juiciest uh, pot I have tried. It would be very awesome for cooking. I am definitely going to attempt to grow some of these. That's good. Hmm. Huh? It's got just a little pinch of heat. Yeah. That's perfect. These would be good for just snacking. 
Just dehydrate it, put them in a bag, pop them. Awesome. Thank you, Randy, for that uh, delicious beaver damn pepper. That was a good little intro. All right. Now to find out how hot this is. I mean, the ingredients, it sounds like it's going to taste good. But the last, the last three ingredients are the ghost pepper, Trinidad scorpion, and the Carolina reaper. So, I mean, I don't know if you can see that, but all along the like ends, like it's, you can see juice. And uh, once again, like I said, um, JoJo's jerky from Las Vegas, Nevada. They got. Um, bunch of other kinds of stuff. This is first time trying anything from them. Yeah, if you want to try this challenge, they send you the jerky for free. You just pay for shipping. Which, I can't remember. The shipping was like seven ninety five. so I mean, I don't know. How, <laughs> it's almost as price as regular jerky, but still. Uh, I don't know how long it's going to, the offer, they'll, you know, have that valid for, but yeah, check that out. Looks like a tasty piece of jerky. I don't think I didn't cook it that good. Ooh, I can smell it. it smells good. It smells like soy sauce, brown sugar. It doesn't. I don't really get much spice smell. You smell yours because I feel like I can smell some <laughs> spice. Yours smells more soy. Same. I think I... I'm getting the same. And now that we sniff each other's uh, <laughs> jerky... I'll sniff yours <laughs> if you sniff mine. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah, that reminds me. <laughs> they give you the... Did you get the sticker? No. They give you the sticker. Just jerk it. Man, I didn't... I love get this sticker. That. Perfect. With all the Nike stuff going on, just jerk it. Dude, I'm putting that on my work locker. <laughs> <laughs> man, I okay, JoJo's jerky. Where's my sticker? That that give really kind of bums me out. Give this man out. a sticker, man. That's so awesome. All right, um, and the rules to this, I mean, there really isn't any. Um, on their website, it just says pretty much the the, the only thing is to eat the entire. The entire thing. There's no time limit. No See nothing. You can go without drinking. So I mean, try it out. JoJo's Let's jerky, black, black label, made, made with, with many sins. Many sins. All right. Let's try it out. It's more moist than I thought it was going to be because it felt kind of hard. So far, delicious. A nice piece of beef jerky. A little bit of heat. Weird texture. It's like in between dry and moist. Yeah. So far, just straight delicious. Um, a little bit of heat. Starting to build a little bit. Creeping. You can taste the peppers. You can also taste like the soy sauce. Mm -hmm. This is the world's hottest jerky. I guarantee it's not. <laughs> right now it's pretty low heat mm -hmm. on my scale. A little bit of burning on my lips. I don't think I'm burning on the lips because with being beef jerky, I'm looking at my lips trying to get moisture going. 
a little bit on my tongue, back of throat, a little bit. That was good jerky though. A lot of flavor. Yeah. <clears throat> I would say heat <clears throat> three. I mean, once you get it down, it's built, but overall, it's not definitely not the world's hottest. I would say a three is a pretty good number. Really good <clears throat> taste. Yeah. Really chewing. good tasting. <clears throat> chewing. <clears throat> I bet their other jerky is really good. Yeah, they offer it like this huge box you could get for like 60, 70 bucks or something. I didn't with, see like, that. Multiple kinds of jerky. I think that would be worth it. Probably. Yeah, definitely not the world's hottest. Now, after eating it all, it's... I mean, it's still kind of building. I don't think it's peaked yet. Ugh, got me a little hiccup. Very good. JoJo's, you're probably going to have to make it a little hotter. Quite a bit more hotter, actually, if you're going to make the world's hottest. It might have went up to a four now, but I don't think it's going to explode any higher than that. No. <sighs> well, that was a tasty video. We were kind of hoping it would be a chill one. <laughs> yeah. Got a lot of stuff coming up. Um, got some stuff coming from Jay's Small Batch. I'm very excited for very excited for I'm excited for that now too <laughs> um got some more Earl's Ghost coming can't wait for that and still got a lot of sauces have yet to try for the video so I just ordered another one chip challenge oh yeah from Etsy version 2.0 OMG they call it oh boy from what I hear it's the most gnarly chip out right now <clears throat> it's probably gonna destroy me that first Etsy chip it's probably did the most damage that really to my gut from my eyes. <laughs> yeah, lots of stuff coming up. Make sure to check out everybody else's um, who's doing this stuff. NJ Pepper Show, Heat 101, Johnny Scoville. I mean, there's so many awesome people out there. Check it all out. Stay tuned for all the awesome stuff coming up. And uh, as always, like, leave a comment, and subscribe.